got today, guys. I've been outside, it's freezing. I couldn't feel my face, hence why I'm like, got as many jackets and t-shirts on underneath as possible. Wow, episode five today, guys. Hope you are all doing well. So today is a bit of a different video compared to the previous ones about the tutorials on social media. Today, I'm gonna be decorating my studio office slash spare bedroom, whatever you like to call it. Um, so yeah, it should be quite fun. Um, however, I'm pretty terrible at DIY decorations and stuff. I have a slight idea, but I'm probably gonna need a hand from my uh, other half and making sure I don't do the wrong thing. So um, yeah, I'm gonna wait for her to, to come home and help me out. When did you guys get in here, eh? You been hiding? Ah, you're smart, aren't you? Hiding behind the sofa. So these managed to sneak in my room. Not me. Uh, we've also got Jaeger, who is addicted to plastic. Hence why he's trying to steal all these bits and pieces from the side. Jaeger, you're not going to say hi to uh, the YouTuber viewers, eh? Come on, buddy. What are you doing? Hmm? Did you find any plastic? No, I hope not, because you've already been ill once. Come on, it's just Jaeger. Hey, <laughs> so my designer slash better half has mm. come in. Um, so today's plan is to decorate this wall. It's totally blank. Um, so we currently have coffee and chili, which I've just done. Um, we've got two baskets that we're going to put on the wall. Uh, a plant. This probably might have to leave out. And then some old pictures. And the old, in the old house that we just found. So we've got like a cafe mocha. Now the problem is we've got three pictures, um, but only two baskets. So we're going to design the wall in Publisher because Shannon's old school like that but no one else can do that it's all Photoshop um, so we're going to see what we can do uh, in Publisher and hopefully get the wall nicely decorated mm. nah, still doesn't look right We've gone from doing publisher to doing the design on the floor. Um, we've tried it a few different ways. And the problem was we couldn't get any more of these baskets. Um, so we wanted really free baskets. Um, so I'm not really sure on how this looks. I think it could be better. Um, why don't we try and swap the light with that picture so all the pictures are on the top. Mm. I'm really not sure. If you flip it around, I can't do it. I'm not touching it around. I think we're going to go for that design. And then this. This is going to be the awkward part. Because I really have bought this and then I feel like we're not going to have it anywhere. Because it's just not going to fit in the wall. So I think we're gonna pretty much have this spaced out across the whole white wall. And then this is just gonna be left alone. Depresso. We'll put it in front of the espresso. But yeah, so if we have the plant in that one, and then I'll put the coffee beans and the, the cup in that one, near nearest to the coffee machine. Does that make sense? Which one is that one, by the way? The marker? Yeah, yeah. that's fine, because I want the espresso on the other side, so that's all right. Do you want the marker in the middle? Yeah, the marker in the middle, yeah. Happy? Before I get stuck down. Happy, yeah. Wait a minute. Don't you dare. Nah, nah, that's definitely not straight. Nah, it's not straight. I'm kidding, man, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> What we need to do is work out how far the cream we want. 
But would it be best off putting the light underneath first and then... So we put the light on underneath. How far down do you want it? Um, yeah, I'd probably say about there actually. Not that much fast. Actually, did, um, put it a bit further down. Further down? Yeah. So about there. Um, nah, it needs to be further up actually. Can you go on a bit more? Yeah, about there. Sure. Sure. No! You lost a letter! Every time it's that E. You know what, if this is wonky, I'm basing everything off this, so everything will be wonky. It doesn't look wonky. Where? Yeah, that'll do. Wherever you are having it. Nah, but definitely further up. <laughs> You're gonna drive me insane, you. <laughs> Up there. Nah, further down. Nah, I'm, I'm kidding. There, yeah, yeah. Honestly. I'm a really good boyfriend, aren't I? <laughs> Do I actually have to answer that question? You don't have to, I already know the answer. <laughs> Alright, where do you want it? About there. Uh, yeah. You sure? Alright. Uh, yeah. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Does that look even? Um, I mean, it would help if the words weren't all over the place, but yeah, I think it does. Uh, so we're gonna take a break. It's uh, about half six now, so we're just letting things settle on the wall. We're gonna order takeaway Chinese. Um, these guys are normally really busy, so uh, hopefully we'll be able to get it. And if the recording looks slightly different, we're recording on the, the Samsung Galaxy S9 while I transfer all the footage that I got from earlier onto the laptop. Um, Anyway, Chinese food. Let's uh, call them to you. Please, please, please answer for the time, it'd be great. Ah! Right, we'll try again soon. But these guys are really good. Um, they're called Butterbelly, if anyone is watching from the Sunland area. <sighs> that is 16 times I have called them. They're obviously really busy. So yeah, we're gonna go outside where it's horrible rainy, windy, and everything else. People are literally dying right now outside. We're gonna go outside and hopefully come back alive with Chinese food. Let's go. That's it, yeah. No, that's great. Thanks. Thank you. Bye. Cheers, bye. So, uh, what happened is we lost one of the cats. Poor Charlie. You alright, Charlie? Mm -hmm. Shanna had locked him in the boiler room. She didn't really. He just snuck in somehow. Um, so then I was like, well, I might as well call it um, takeaway again and see if they're open. And they were. So, well, they were open, but they were really busy. But this time they answered the call. So. Thankfully, I didn't have to leave the house because you got lost. Thanks, Charlie. <laughs> so we're just waiting for the food now. Chinese food's here, boys and girls. 